Hey guys, what's up? Denise Salcedo, and right now I am backstage at the Impact TV tapings at Sam's Town, Las Vegas. As you can tell, we're all glammed up, and I am hanging out here with Ethan Page. Ethan, first of all, cool shirt. I was just gonna say, I'm not glammed up right now, <laughs> but I am wearing my <laughs> Ethan Page t-shirt. You know those moments when you just make up words? It's so weird. I, I mean, don't know, but you look glam to me. Though. You're glammed up. Thank you. Yeah, no problem, no problem. <laughs> All right, so Ethan, first of all, congratulations on you know becoming a part of the Impact roster. I want to know, what does it mean for you to now be a regular on Impact? Well, true story, um, I, in my singles match against Trevor Lee, uh, we got to watch it back on television, and my wife and I were sitting on the couch, and we were watching it together, and I was like, oh, this is kind of cool. And she looked at me, and she was like, it was in a very surreal moment, she was like, oh, are you living your dream right now, like your childhood dream? Like, this is kind of cool that I get to, like, see this. And I was like, yeah, I'm watching myself on TV, and I'm, like, getting texts from family members and stuff like that. So, yeah, it means a lot, to be honest with you, yeah. Well, I mean, you've wrestled all over the world, and to now come out here and, you know, be able to kind of see your hard work come out in fruition, like you said, seeing yourself on TV, does it feel a little surreal, or how does that feel for yeah. you? I know it must be weird, right? Yeah, I mean, you took literally took the words out of my mouth. It was surreal, and uh, but, like, it never ends, and... I'm one of those people that once I hit a goal, there's always something else. Like even today, like this is the first time I've worked in Las Vegas. Oh, nice. Yeah, so. Is this your first time in Las Vegas too or no? I'm not allowed to talk about that. Ah, okay, okay. <laughs> no, I've been here, don't worry. I've enjoyed Sin City. <laughs> but uh, the first time I've gotten to work here and uh, first time I got to work in Mexico was for Impact too. So getting to do Impact is great. Um, being here is great, being on the roster is great, but I'm also still experiencing new things and new places, which is amazing. How was it like working in Mexico? It's, it's very strange. Uh, not a full experience for me just yet because that was my debut and all I did was run down the ramp and powerbomb Rich Swan into the ring, but uh, I get to check that one off the international bucket list. Awesome. Now, you've been working closely with Matt Seidel, obviously. I want to know how... Are you guys going to be going for the tag team titles eventually here? I think yes, because my name is All Ego and I'm very confident. And I think that, yeah, of course, we're going to end up not even going for them, but winning them. But I don't think anytime soon. Uh, we're kind of hitting some rocky roads. And like you saw tonight, I don't know when this is airing, but Matt ended up losing to Johnny Impact, who I saw you interviewing before me. <laughs> But that's okay. That's okay. I'll let that one slide. Um, that's a goal of mine is to not only win a title, but win the tag titles with Matt. Uh, but the future will tell. So we'll have to wait and see. Awesome. And now, like we said, we mentioned here that, you know, Impact is here taping in Las Vegas. How important do you think it is for Impact to sort of, you know, they've been touring since April all around different places, like you said, Mexico. How important do you think it was for them to leave the Impact Zone, leave the comfort of the Impact Zone, and, you know, sort of do all of these different tapings around the world? How important do you think it is for the growth of the company? See, I don't really think you should focus on that. I think what you should be focusing on is the fact that it's the best case scenario that Impact Wrestling gets to travel uh, abroad because we're bringing the best professional wrestling roster all over the world. And it's not just North America. Like we, you saw, we did a pay-per-view in Canada. We did TV tapings in Canada. We went to Mexico. Now we're here in Las Vegas. So we were in New York City for Bound for Glory. And now the world gets to see what our roster is capable of. And I think that's the best. And last question for you. I want to know, 2019 is really just around the corner. What Soon. big plans do you have or what are your hopes to, for the future of 2019 and Impact Wrestling? Well, for me, Ethan Page's first official match for Impact Wrestling was at Bound for Glory. And that was my debut on pay-per-view. So I debuted on the biggest pay-per-view uh, in the Impact list. So coming in January, I would hope that Ethan Page would be featured at Homecoming the next pay-per-view so I can continue the success that I've had in the company. Incredible. Well, I think you will. Ethan Page, thank you so much for talking no to us. And I will let you go and enjoy the rest of the show here sure. today. All right, guys. Ethan Page.